Hi everyone, this is Arun here with Liferay 6.2 tutorial 4 and in this tutorial I will be explaining few customization of a, a site. We have created uh, a site in the last session and I just want to modify that site in terms of colors and all uh, logos those things I want to edit those. I am just logged in as Joblox and going to the control panel he's the uh, super admin and what I am going to do is clicking on the sites and this is listing all the sites which I have available in the life ray portal so this li Arun's life ray is the one which I have created last week I'm just clicking on the link it will be opening up me the site pages I can see the site public pages and private pages if I want to add more pages over here I can add click on the add page button this will open up a new form and I can fill up the uh, new page name whatever I want and I can add it to the site so that will be added where I am selecting the currently I selected public pages if I am selecting public pages it will be added to public pages if I want to add it in private page then I need to click on the private pages tab and then click on the add page so this is where I'm just uh, going to have a change in the color scheme what I'm going to do is changing the color scheme you can see the color schemes as default dark and I the default one is the pre-selected one I just want to change it into dark and what I'm going to do is I just save this option and in another browser I have opened up this site URL already this is the public URL for the particular site Arun's life ray I'm just clicking on this and refreshing this you can see this got changed into a dark background and this time I'm just refreshing the private page you, you can see the uh, it is the group that is the private one so the private is still the old default um, color schemes is applied because I didn't change that color schemes by clicking the private pages so private pages still have the default color I can change this by clicking here dark and just save it and what I can do is the private page I'm going to refresh I can see that also reflected with the dark color scheme so this is how we can change the color scheme and I have created one logo using the paint it's just for the training this is not kind of a logo or not kind of a good uh, header I, uh, I could say so what I can do is I can click on this logo and choose file and uh, from the desktop I, I'm going to choose the file name I have created logo1.png and just opening this so I am just saving this and let us see what what could be the um, difference it made into the site I am just refreshing this you can see Arun's training site logo is came up here and if you refresh here it won't it is actually um, showing here with the uh, Arun's life right? this is the public page and this is the private page so both the logo is added for both the public site and private site so we can customize um, um, one by one for a page I can give header uh, for uh, public pages I can give header for private pages alone I can give header so those things is possible so it's I selected show site name over here that's why the old uh, site name also was displaying here so now I am refreshing this and uh, I will not be seeing the site name displaying so that's an optional thing you can you want to m highlight the site name then you choose it otherwise you can drop it and uh, and I'm just um, clicking on this one and just clicking on home and here I can see the look and feel so this page uh, I want to change some um, additional stuffs like um, the page styles and all so those things I can change it here and what I'm doing is I'm just going back to the public pages I just want to show you can add your JavaScript code some JavaScript codes that you really want to add you can add those JavaScript code here I just want to uh, show you just an alert message now I am just giving an alert um, this is 
Arun's message. I just want to do this and uh, just saving this up. And this is the public pages I have given this JavaScript. I'm just refreshing. You see that this is Arun's message. That message alert is popping up. And just going back and I'm just uh, giving you another modification like a function I am going to uh, create a show message so I'm just giving a function here uh, just let me put an a simple alert so alert like this message called from show message function okay so just a semicolon and what I'm doing is I'm just calling this show message function directly from the body and just saving this up and now if you refresh what you will see is you will see the message called from show message function so this is how you, you want to modify something using you want to do something using the uh, JavaScript side you can do that over here I just um, removed that functionality I, I just don't want the, uh, to do that just wanted to show you guys how this can be done so that is the way how we can customize few things on life ray sites and in the next tutorial we will be learning about the site URLs public page private page URLs and how we will be changing the URLs those steps we will be learning in the next tutorial thank you for watching keep watching subscribe our channel thank you